um, I just wanted to get on here real quick. I haven't had a dream that I've needed to share lately, but I did yesterday. Um, I wanted to make a video, well I did, but it didn't come out very well, so I'm having to redo it, but, um, I made a video yesterday, um, because, um, when I woke up in the morning, uh, I had, I don't, I don't know if I want to call it a vision, because it wasn't super bright, and, um, and it, it just was, I just closed my eyes and I saw an image. And what I saw was, imagine, uh, like, one by one stones, like old-fashioned stones that they, they use when they're, like, building an ancient building. Like, one foot by one foot stones. It was, like, a row of stones, one layer, then another row of stones, another row of stones. Just all laid, single layer. all the way across, just a big, like, foundation of these squares. And then all of a sudden I saw a rolling underneath these squares. So the first row would, would, so the first row would lift up, and then it kind of went like a wave like that. And I saw it go all the way down the foundation. And I was thinking, that's weird. And then, then the next thing I saw was, <laughs> this was pretty vivid, which is strange, is I was behind a dragon. Don't know why a dragon um, from behind. You could see his wings out and his feet kind of dangling, and there were buildings, and he was just flying down the streets of a downtown city, and I just thought that's strange. Um. Anyway, so I was waking up. This was I was already awake. I wasn't asleep. I just had my eyes closed. I was in between, you know, just waking up, and I picked up my phone. <laughs> to look at, for whatever reason, I was compelled to look at the news right away. And as soon as I opened it up, there it is, 6.0 earthquake in, um, you know, California. And I was like, and then I read the description, and it said rolling, that it felt like a rolling. It was a rolling earthquake as opposed to just a rumbling. It was a, it was rolling in waves. Um, the only reason why I'm sharing this now, coincidence or not, I mean, it could be, but it just seems like he's, he's just saying, basically, these are the birth pangs. This is it. Like, this is a part of it. Um, and what I wanted to share with you is something that's been weighing on me for a long time. We do know that our brothers and sisters in, in Christ in the Middle East, you know, have been being persecuted and, um, they're already in tribulation. They've already flown to the hills to escape, you know, in the mountains. Um, they're start. It's starting. I mean, it's gonna be birth pains. It's gonna get worse and worse and worse. But it's already begun. Um, we as Americans are very fortunate to have had God covering us, but that's starting to lift. Um, I don't believe their warnings anymore. Well, they have to be because there weren't any significant casualties that I know of as of yet. I just think there were three, three people we need to pray for who were in critical condition. Um, I haven't read the news. I'm not up to date on it right now, but, um, it's going to get worse and worse. And we just need to pray for grace and mercy, because um, God's capable of anything. And um, we have to st we have to not look at things just from an American point of view too. This is all over the globe. Our brothers and sisters in Christ, everybody is about to feel this. Everybody. Um, we have to. We have to we have to come together, and we have to be ready for anything, because we God's been giving us hints. God's been tapping us on the shoulder. God's been talking to us. God's been giving us words through some of you who have been kind enough to share and give your time. And I thank you because you've you all have helped me so much. You don't even know. I mean, I spend a lot of my time if I'm not you know in prayer or 
in the Bible. I'm I'm looking for for my friends here to help uplift me and give me kind word and and um, loving encouragement and and I think we should just be there in peace and love with each other and we we need that. We need each other. This is a time when we come together and um My main thing is I'm saying thank, be thank, I'm I'm thankful for you all, and um, as Americans we need to realize that it doesn't just affect us; it's everywhere, and so it doesn't start when it hits America. It's already starting. Um, so we have our judgment coming too. That's true. Um, but this is. This is God talking to all his children, all of us. Um, it is time to, to unite. But um, the Holy Spirit is guiding us, which is super exciting. Um, I am so, so, so excited to have Jesus come. Y'all, I'm so happy. Like, I'm so excited. But... There is a sadness, and I'm very sad because I, I can't help but think about the other people out there. And I think you've, if you've seen my other videos, you know how I am about it. I want Jesus to come, but oh my goodness, I, there's so many people out there, so many, and some people just, he has to reach them a different way, unfortunately, you know. But we still have to, we still have to be out there and put on our armor and. And be good brothers and sisters to them as well. I'm ready for anything. So I'm going to be here as long as he wants me to be here. And I'm going to serve as long as he wants me to serve down here. So I'm excited though. Things are going to be different. Just keep praying. Keep praying for souls. Keep praying for each other. Keep praying that um, we're going to, well, I, I don't know. I'm kind of in like a a very contemplative state right now, so I'm sorry my mind's not, I just have, I have a lot on my mind, especially after seeing what I saw and, and everything that's happening right now, just, I kind of just want to be in prayer right now, and so I pray for all of you, please pray for me, please, I need it, I need it just as much, so please pray for me as well, um, or, we're almost there, guys. We're almost there. He's coming. He's coming. I'm so excited. Anyways, I love you all. God bless. Y'all have a great evening. And I'm sure I'll be hearing from some of y'all soon. If um, And maybe I'll be seeing y'all soon. I don't know. All right. God bless. Talk to you later. Bye.